Well, hello and welcome. This is Rob. I've uh, signed up for uh, prostate cancer in January, uh, where I'm gonna technically walk uh, or run uh, a marathon during the month, so not all at once. Um, it will be effectively 26.2 miles over the course of January. I'm no stranger to running. Um, I have previously run for a local running club uh, and have competed at 10k races um, and I've also competed at probably a, a dozen or so half marathons. However, I've not run since 2011. This is January 2024, so there's been a 13 year gap in me running. I have no idea whatsoever if I'm gonna be able to uh, just pick it straight back up and uh, you know, really enjoy my run, my gut instinct as I'm gonna be <laughs> really breathing heavy and struggling um, to do any sort of run at all. Um, I was gonna run on Sunday the 7th of January, it's my first run. Fortunately, um, my wife's able to, uh, it's Thursday, it's, what day, date is it? Th um, January the 3rd, I think, it was our 4th, it's Thursday. It's my day off, um, my wife's home, so there's still a little bit of light around where I am now, so I thought I'd just go out, but uh, yeah. So I thought I'd uh, go out and have a little run. I'm just doing a, a little warm up, I guess, so to speak, just a little walk and just acclimatise into the outdoors until I start running. I've got somebody coming with a dog, so I'll walk up here. Uh, so yeah, I just wanted to say hello. Uh, this is gonna be uh, a regular occurrence. My intention is to, I've got people everywhere, I have to move. Uh, my intention is to basically track what I'm doing throughout the month of January uh, to all those people who have donated. Thank you very much so far. And I hope there's a lot more to come. I'm trying to raise, well, I set a goal at 300 pounds. Um, I'm hoping I can get more than that, but if I can get 300 pain, that would be great. Everything helps towards prostate cancer. Don't want to go into it too much, um, but I've got friends uh, uh, with cancer at the moment. I've also got family members with cancer. And I lost my mum to cancer. I love that was breast cancer. Uh, any type of cancer is not a nice thing to have. Um, and if we can support people, uh, with this horrible disease, it's uh, it's all good. Uh, so I encourage you to get out and get walking, get fit. There's lots of cancer charities about, and if you can help any of them out, um, that would be absolutely fantastic. I will link my link in the description below. So if you would like to contribute, two pound fifty, five pound, it all helps. Anything you'd like to contribute, it would be very, very much appreciated. <sighs> I'm out of breath, I'm sat running yet. Um, so like I said, I'm just gonna create a little log um, and upload it onto YouTube and, and I think I can upload it onto my Just Give page as well. Um, so for those who are interested, we can uh, share this experience together, let's say. I'm gonna start here. So, so I'm just going onto activities on my phone. Open door run, three, two, one, and here I go. <laughs> I'm not obviously going to film all the way round, but I am starting to run in and I will come back to you when I'm a little way round the course I'm going to run today. I'll speak to you in a few minutes. Okay, welcome back. Oh, I now understand why I gave up running. My watch is gone. You would think I'd done five miles. I've actually done 1K, not even a mile. I'm shattered. Uh, let's see if I can make two. See you in a bit. Oh, there we go. I don't know whether you can see that or not. I've not got my specs on my contact, so I can't. Uh, but I'm absolutely shattered.
Welcome back. I'm 2K in. How demoralizing. Keep going, Rob. You're doing it for a good cause. Yeah, it's true. Hello, welcome back. Oh, as you can see, I've stopped. Well, <clears throat> the watch has stopped, by the way, and I'm not tracking any more steps or miles. <clears throat> but I just want to give you an update. <clears throat> I managed to push out 3K, which <clears throat> knowing what I'm capable of, I'm a little bit disappointed. However, I intend to get out and run in a couple of days time as well and I'm very aware that when you go back to something <clears throat> my legs are going to be like rocks tomorrow and probably even worse the day after don't forget I've not put a pair of trainers on and run in about 12-13 years again today wasn't so much about the run it was more about seeing where I am from a physical and mental state in terms of getting out and exercising um, and yeah blowing some cobwebs out I'm hoping that when I come towards the end of the month and I've uh, probably done I don't know six, seven, eight runs maybe because they're going to have to be short sharp and sweet my aim was really to do between um, <clears throat> I guess three and five miles a run didn't compete that this time around but there's a benchmark there's a benchmark and that's how we all start off it doesn't matter what shape you're in where you are mentally if you can dedicate maybe a couple of hours a week you know maybe 20 30 minute runs three or four times a week that's all it takes um, there's the Fit uh, Couch to 5K, which some of my friends have, have started and they were going on and actually running right on a regular basis. <clears throat> and then there's things like I'm doing today for prostate cancer, where we're simply just getting out, having a run and trying to raise money for charity uh, along the way. So once again, I'll link my link in the descrip description below. You don't have to give a lot. But if you can give a couple of quid, I would appreciate it. And so with the many men around the world who are, have got that horrible disease, prostate cancer. I don't know whether you know, um, but one in eight men are affected by prostate cancer. Fortunately, we are lucky because if caught early, prostate cancer is very treatable. And there's a lot of other cancer charities out there who would love your support as well. Um, so see if you can get involved keep fit in the meantime thank you for watching my first vlog sorry it wasn't a bit more entertaining or perhaps you like seeing me suffer and this was very entertaining for you i've got a bit of a walk home now um which is good nice little bit of a cool down and it all helps with my fitness regardless thanks for watching see you on the next video think about smashing subscribe and uh, liking the page if you want to keep up to date with my endeavours over the next month or so. See you next time. Bye-bye. So, back on camera, just as I'm walking home, because I've got quite some way to get there. Um, again, I haven't got my contacts and my specs on, so I can't, it's hard to see my watch, but, and I will post my times on the screen on this video when you're watching it, but, I think it was about 19 minutes just did 3k so at my working out if i was doing 5k which is kind of standard in the uk to run i would have done it in about 30 minutes so having not run in 12 13 years if i'd competed and i didn't do it of course i did 3k but if i'd done 5k in 30 minutes i would have been horrified with that normally but of course, having not done that, it's not such a bad time. 
when I was running on a regular basis, I would compete 5K in something between 19 and maybe 22 minutes, something like that. So obviously doing it in 30 minutes, theoretically, if I did that distance, a bit disappointing, but again, just trying to get my sort of benchmark. Um, believe it or not, I'm pushing 50 now. So I know I'm not gonna be as quick as I was before, but I would still like to think that I could achieve with a little bit of fitness, a little bit of practice, <coughs> I'd really hope to be doing 5K in about 25 minutes. I think that's realistic and achievable. Um, what are your thoughts? Do you do you run? Uh, if you do, drop me a comment, say hello. Let me know what sort of times you're doing. I'm not really competing with you. It's just nice to have a little bit of uh, somebody commenting and spurring you on, isn't it? You know. Anyway. Still plenty of walking to do. I promise this is this is the last one today. I'll see you in the next video. Take care.